I started belly dancing in uh, 2003, 20 years ago. Uh, and I came to Dubai 15 years ago. When I just arrived in Dubai, uh, I had the chance to be exclusive for Atlantis Hotel. So I, since the opening, I was working for them for three years. I was doing modeling in Brazil and I was in, I wanted to be a fashion model. And in my city in Sao Paulo, you have to be very skinny. Especially I wanted to go, my dream was to work in Milan or New York, but you have to be very skinny. So I tried to be more skinny and more in a level that I had anorexia. I was 10 kilos less than now and the agency is still telling me that I have to lose three kilos. So that time I was very depressed, very down, and I decided to do something for fun, just to relax. And I chose belly dancing. The moment I started, I felt something like, I felt happy, I felt like, when I was like, because when you have anorexia, you always see yourself not beautiful. And I was in the cover of many magazines, but I was not feeling myself beautiful or attractive. attractive. And with the belly dancing, I start to feel again that, you know, I. When I move, and my teacher was amazing, it was, was a Lebanese lady older, and she was not in a model of a look at all, but she was very confident and very happy with herself. And this was my inspiration to keep going. I get very emotional <laughs> because it was like the medicine of my depression. And uh, until now, for me, belly dancing is like, it's a blessing. My teacher was telling me, you are a model. If you start to do professionally, you'll be like, you'll be very special because you, your profile is completely different than a lot of belly dancers. So you'll be very unique if you decide to do this. But I was not convinced. I was like, no, no, it's not a job. I'm doing for fun. And I went to a psychologist that time and I said, I want to find something that I do and I love. And she said, you should be a dancer. And I was laughing. I was like, no, no, a dancer. Because my father, the, his dream was me to work in a bank, uh, you know, like uh, to be like a businesswoman, not a, a dancer, I think. He never thought about this for me. But uh, everything I do related to dance works very well. Everything I do in my life that's related to dance, the doors open like this. So that's why I... I realized that it's for me, it was in my journey. Since the Corona time that I couldn't perform, so I decided to come back to teach. And I started to teach celebrities. My students, I have students with 20 million followers, 5 million followers, 7 million. And I have very high profile students. They are very private. I'm very happy to teach now, especially because I want to move more to this way. I start to teach online as well. I'm launching very soon my online classes so I can teach also ladies. They don't live in Dubai. So usually I will wake up 6.30 in the morning. I prepare my son to go to the school and then I start teaching my classes. I also take classes yoga. In the afternoon, I always try to focus on my company to see what's going on, which events we have, if we need choreography, what's like, I, I want to make sure that everything is really well. And in the evening, I perform. I perform in one restaurant four times per week. And I perform also in a lounge in GIFC that uh, is only on Saturdays. I also do a lot of private events like corporate events, weddings, henna parts. Uh, sometimes birthday. When I dance, I want people to be like in a dream, you know? I want this. That's what I look for. We are there to make the environment magical, bring happiness. One thing that I want to make very clear that belly dancers, a proper professional belly dancer, is not there to seduce anyone or to be teasing around. This is not a professional belly dancer. If you see someone doing this, it means 
she's not professional. She's not doing what she needs to do. We come to show an art, a culture, uh, bring happiness, change the environment, like change the ambience for something happy, beauty. Like, you know, we, we should give like the beauty of life, the art, the music, the movement, the technique, the things that people see and say, oh, I wish I know how to do it, but I cannot do it. This is a professional dancer. Technique, you see, you know, she trained so much to be able to do this. This is very professional. I can see that belly dancing is something that uh, you need to develop also yourself a lot to become like a professional belly dancer. It's like not all the other dancers, of course, you need to be very professional, but I feel like in belly dance, there's, there is something that should also work a lot. You are um, self-confident, uh, your emotions, is more, is something like very deep. It's a very deep dancing. It's not something like you learn a choreography and you can do it. Belly dancing is like, you need to develop a lot of things on you to become a belly dancer. You need to understand the whole culture. Inside belly dancer, we have Haliji, that's the golf dance. Inside belly dance, we have the Egyptian style, the Lebanese style, the Iraq style. And everything is completely different. The rhythms represent different things. So to be able to be a professional belly dancer, if you don't understand the culture, you cannot work in an Arabic country, like, because it's very tricky, you know, like, the way you dance Haliji is completely different than the way you dance Egyptian uh, the, uh, style. One door that opened for me that I loved so much was the my work in Cannes. I love to work in south of France. It was like a, a really blessing to have this connection there. I perform every evening and uh, with another group of artists from all around the world. It's amazing. I stay the summer there. I meet very interesting people. The perspective of people is very nice. Also, uh, one show I did for Louis Vuitton, I think was one of the best show I the show I felt more, I mean, I felt very, very happy to do this. What made me very happy also, I performed for president of some countries. This is, was really nice for me to, to perform. The Qatar World Cup also I performed. I didn't perform in the main event, but I was there for a few events. It was really, really nice. And one show that I, for me also, I'll never forget, I did in Los, Ange Los Angeles, in Beverly Hills. I perform it for uh, Etihad. Elishimi! Ciao, ciao!